Hey YouTube, Carolina Gun here with a review on the Rome RG20. Uh, it's a 22 short revolver that uh, my grandpa gave me a couple months ago uh, that he picked up in the Navy back in the 50s uh, over in Germany. It is made in Germany uh, between 1950s and the 1960s, I believe. Um, the surface on this gun is uh, pretty worn, uh, kind of in rough shape. Uh, six shot. So it's pretty pretty fun and cheap to shoot if you can find the 22 short ammo. I did recently pick up a box I found at a local gun shop for about $11. Um, pretty tight gun. The cylinder's pretty tight, and as you've seen, it was unloaded. Um, the action on this gun is really tight. Uh, if you try to pull it, you know, like that, to shoot off to six rounds, it's pretty hard. Uh, trigger's really heavy. If you pull it back... Pull the hammer back and fire it this way. You can stay on target a lot easier. It just makes for an easier trigger pull. Of course, you see how far the trigger comes back when you engage the hammer. It comes back almost all the way. So there's not really a really heavy uh, trigger pull there. I mean, not even not even nothing. I mean, but here, when you go to pull it back, it's, it's pretty heavy. I mean, you see how far you got to pull it. You see my finger turning red there trying to pull it. Really, like I said, really fun gun to shoot. Don't know much about it, so I'm not going to get into history detail on it. Uh, like I said, got it as a gift. A lot of people say that they don't like them because they're inaccurate. They're the worst guns. Run if you see one. But you know what? Everybody's got their opinions on them. Uh, a lot of people say that when you're firing these, especially the these models, uh, the revolver models, um, that their sparks come out the side here when you fire this thing. I've never had that happen, nor have I seen anybody do a video showing it happening, so I don't know if that's just something that they've had. Maybe a, maybe they've reloaded their own ammo and they've had an ammo, you know, uh, fault or something like that. It does have a cylinder that pulls out like a normal uh, full-size revolver. You pull the little plunger there and it slides out. And it, uh, Some of these models, uh, the the cylinder actually comes all the way off the gun, which is the smaller model. I don't know the model num number exactly. Uh, but this gun is what I've heard is the one that they use to shoot Reagan with outside the Hilton Hotel. Um, so pretty dangerous gun. Uh, really easy to shoot. Like I said, any age group could shoot this gun. Uh, the 22 short ammo, pretty you know cheap ammo if you can find it right now. No ammo shortage. All that, you know, it makes it hard to find. But when you do have it, like I said, I got 100 rounds there for about $11. If you have any other questions about this gun, please feel free to, you know, let me know. Uh, either a message or comment. Um, like I said, I'm not a history buff on this one. So I'm just going to, I just felt like doing a, a review on it. And hopefully here in the next few weeks I can do a range review on this one. Uh, just to show you how, how fun it is to shoot. This has been Carolina Gunn for your review on the RG620 German Revolver.